So here I am looking at this case record in Salesforce for the contact of Abraham Lincoln. And suppose as the customer service rep, while I'm working on this ticket, I also would like to be able to see all of the other activities, both open activities as well as activity history, related to this contact, even though those activities have nothing to do with this particular case, because when I'm interacting with the contact, uh, he might bring up a recent conversation or an open activity that someone else on the team is supposed to follow up with him about, and I do not want to be caught off guard when I reach out to him regarding this particular case. So even though I could see over here on the right-hand side of the screen, there are no activities associated to this particular case, I want to see the other activities that have to do with this contact of Abraham Lincoln. So how do I do it? Well, first of all, you need to be an admin you need, or you need to have admin Salesforce admin access in order to do what I'm about to show you. So I'm going to go over here in Lightning Experience on the upper right hand side. I'm going to click on the little gear icon. I'm going to click on edit page. The screen is going to refresh. I'm going to be in the page builder. And once the screen comes up, I'm going to go over here on the left hand side and I can see one of the options I have here is related list single. And let's go ahead and drag that onto the screen. So I'm going to put it right over here. And right now we can see that by default it shows activity history. We can leave it alone as activity history because that is in fact one of the items that we want. And now up above where it says parent record instead of use this case, I want to update that and I want to choose contact name. So it's going to show the activity history related to the contact. Contact is a lookup on the case and we can see it right over here on the left hand side where Abraham Lincoln is the contact the look up to this case. So it's going to show the activity history for the parent record of contact name. And we can see that the screen has already refreshed. The preview has already refreshed to show me some of those activities. Now I want to do the exact same thing for the open activity. So let's go back on the left hand side of the screen under related list single. Let's go ahead and drag that over, plop that down on the screen. And now instead of activity history, I want to change this and I want to select open activities. And again, instead of using use this case, I'm going to click in here and I'm going to choose contact name. And again, I can see that the screen has refreshed and I'm looking at open activities for the parent contact as well as activity history for the parent contact. Now, just logically, I might want to swap the order here to look at open activities first. So I'm just going to drag it up and let go and it refreshes. Now I'm going to simply hit save. Let's go back to the actual record. And once we do that, we're going to see. There we go. So now we're going to see that even though we don't have any activities regarding this particular case, if I'm about to call Abraham Lincoln, the contact associated to this record, I can see the open activities related to the contact. I can also see what they're about. If I navigate into it or if I update the uh, hover, the fields that are displayed on the hover, I can see who's responsible for them, what is the due date associated with it, etc. And I can do the same thing for activity history. If you're looking for more Salesforce end user training videos, either for yourself or your team, you'll want to head over to Brainiate Academy, where I've got online, on demand Salesforce training courses for end users. They will turn you into a Salesforce rock star. By enrolling in Brainiac Academy courses, you will get access to a private group of students and to a Salesforce MVP as your instructor. You can even reach out with your own personal Salesforce struggles, and we will do whatever we can to help address them painlessly. Click on the link below to enroll in Brainiac Academy today. I am super thrilled to be part of your journey in learning how to use Salesforce. Keep up the awesome work and have a magnificent day.